The F-15 Eagle is one of the most successful fighter jets ever built. A combat aircraft that has dominated the skies for over four decades without a single loss in air-to-air -air combat. This highly capable fighter jet was engineered to deliver a powerful mix of offensive firepower and defensive survivability, making it one of the most versatile combat aircraft in history. The airplane we're unveiling today represents a major addition to our foundation of strength. When it first flew in 1972, the F-15 Eagle immediately set a new standard for air combat and quickly became the most recognizable symbol of American air superiority. Built by McDonnell Douglas, the jet went on to fly in key missions around the globe, including the Gulf War's Operation Desert Storm. The F-15 can be equipped with an arsenal of advanced weaponry, giving it a wide variety of air-to-air -air combat options. Its armament includes AIM-120 AMRAMs, carried beneath the fuselage for long-range engagements. It also uses AIM-9 Sidewinder missiles mounted on wing pylons for close-range dogfights. And as a last line of defense, the Eagle carries an internal 20mm Vulcan Gatling gun hidden in the wing route. Loading these weapons is the responsibility of a specialized team of Air Force personnel known as weapon loaders. They operate under strict procedures to ensure that every missile is safely armed and secured to the aircraft before flight. Each missile is carefully inspected, then lifted onto a jammer vehicle and transported to the waiting jet. From there, loaders attach the weapons to the pylons, locking them firmly in place for combat missions. Powering the aircraft are two Pratt and Whitney engines that together produce an astonishing 50,000 pounds of afterburner thrust. As the pilot advances the throttles, raw firepower erupts from the exhaust nozzles in bright, roaring flames. Once the afterburners ignite, the Eagle generates more thrust than twice its weight, giving it incredible acceleration on takeoff. With a sharp pull on the stick, the jet can climb almost vertically into the sky in a matter of seconds. All of this is controlled from a cockpit that remains one of the most advanced and demanding in aviation history. It was designed to give the pilot maximum awareness, with every instrument tailored for high-intensity combat operations. Key systems include a heads-up display, multiple multifunction screens, throttle and stick controls, and integrated radios and targeting systems. This highly complex setup is why flying the F-15 requires years of training and constant practice. Another defining feature of the aircraft is its two-seat configuration with a rear cockpit that serves as the navigator station. The second crew member assists the pilot by managing radar and weapon systems during intense missions. Because both cockpits share identical controls, the navigator can also fly the aircraft if the pilot becomes incapacitated. Beyond offensive firepower, the Eagle also excels in defense thanks to its advanced electronic warfare system. This system deploys countermeasures ranging from heat-seeking flares to advanced radar jamming technology. 
Since eagles often deploy to distant battlefields, they require additional fuel to reach their targets. For that reason, aerial refueling tankers are used to extend their range mid-flight. The F-15 approaches a tanker with precise coordination, matching speed as the refueling boom lines up with the aircraft's intake. The boom operator and pilot remain in constant communication to ensure fuel is delivered safely at high altitude. Once the tanks are topped off, the aircraft separates and continues its mission without ever landing. At the heart of this performance are two Pratt and Whitney F-100 engines mounted side by side inside the fuselage. These engines are fed by large rectangular intakes with variable ramps that regulate airflow at high speeds. Like all advanced aircraft, the Eagle's engines require strict and frequent maintenance by Air Force specialists. When issues are detected, entire engines are removed from the aircraft and transported to specialized repair facilities. Technicians carefully extract the engine to allow full access for inspections and part replacements. They check for problems ranging from oil leaks to turbine wear and repair or replace parts as needed. Each engine is tested under extreme conditions to guarantee it can handle the stresses of combat. Testing is conducted inside a hush house, an enclosed sound suppressed facility designed to withstand the roar of jet engines. These facilities allow engineers to simulate real flight loads while keeping noise and exhaust contained. Some hush houses are large enough to test entire aircraft, making them vital to Air Force operations. In these cases, the jet is strapped down by heavy holdback devices to resist the immense engine thrust during testing. In 2018, the Air Force partnered with Boeing to develop a next-generation Eagle known as the F-15EX. This program built on decades of experience while preparing the aircraft for modern combat threats. The F-15EX was designed to replace aging F-15C and F-15D fighters in service. Its upgrades include the AMBER system, which allows it to carry up to 22 air-to-air -air missiles in a single mission. With these systems, the jet can defend American airspace and deploy long-range standoff weapons. However, critics warn that even with these upgrades, the F-15EX may struggle to survive against the most advanced air defenses by 2028. If you're enjoying this video, don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more content like this.